Are you enjoying the wedding? Because you don't look so good. I, um, I just haven't been sleeping very well. I've been having these really weird dreams, man. Like, oh, I had one the other night where there's this really old wand maker dude. And he's, he's making these wands. I didn't even know who he was. And, and Voldemort killed him. So you've never seen this guy before, right? Well, Voldemort said his name was, like, Gregor Gavigich, something like that. But no, I don't know him. Harry, I don't think that was a dream. You, you, haven't you heard before that every person you see in a dream is someone you've seen in real life? Is it possible that you're getting visions from Voldemort again? <laughs> If these are visions of Voldemort, I don't want anyone to know. Ah, Harrison, ah. glad you could make it. I'm here to read the will of Albus Percival Wolfric Brian Zumbledore. To Ronald Billius Weasley, I That's leave my, my Deluminator, my one-of-a-kind invention. Here you go, son. Whoa, cool. What's it do? Do you, like, turn the lights off? No, but when I used it at Bill's wedding, uh, it let, produced a little ball of light, and it led me directly to the sandwiches. So, I mean, that's something. Uh, to Hermione Jean Granger, uh, I leave the diadem of Rowena Ravenclaw. Unfortunately, the uh, diadem was not his to give. It actually belongs to a collector named Horace Slughorn. I don't know if you've heard of him. He's pretty famous. All right, last thing on the uh, crinkly piece of paper. Uh, to Harrison Jameson Potter, I leave uh, the Sword of Godric Gryffindor. I get the Sword of Gryffindor? No. Dumbledore again. Assume that something was his that actually didn't belong to him. The sword actually belongs to Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. But you know, it's a thought that counts, don't you agree? Wait a minute. The only one who gets something from Dumbledore is Ron? Well, Dumbledore I... didn't even like Ron! That's what you think. Now that you mention it, Harrison, he also left you the first snitch that you ever caught in Quidditch. Hey, that, that's pretty cool. Wait, wait a minute, the first snitch I ever caught was Neville. That's why I wasn't going to mention it. Now, if you excuse me, the wedding reception is still happening outside. And those sandwiches look delicious. Dude, they looked good enough to die for. I know, right? I think I'm gonna go do that. I'll see you guys later. Okay, guys. It's time to talk horcruxes. The first step in our mission uh, is... Uh, guys? What's a horcrux? We should tell her. Okay, Jennifer. Here's the deal. It all started before my parents even died. Lord Voldemort split his soul into seven pieces. One of them is him, and then the other six are in little objects called Horcruxes. Now we need to defeat these Horcruxes before we can ever hope to kill Voldemort. So what does a Horcrux look like? They could be anything, but we already destroyed two. One of them being Tom Riddle's old diary you found in movie two, and the other one being Voldemort's family ring. One of them is the Slytherin's locket that Dumbledore and Harry went looking for last year, but they only found a decoy with a note in it that said CRV. So after the wedding, we're going to go look for the locket. Is there anything I can do to help? No, Ginny. I can't let you come. And I also can't see you anymore. It's not you. It's all the villains who are after me. I can't let you be in danger. I can't let any girl who's as important to me as you get in any harm. Why am I going? Be quiet. Spider-Man did this for Mary Jane, and I'm gonna do it for you. That was Gwen Stacy. What? Food, where's the food at this wedding? Hi, Harry. Hey, Luna. This is my dad. Hi, I'm Harry Potter. Pleasure to meet you, Harry Potter. My name is Xenophilius Lovegood, and I run a newspaper called The Quibbler. And I just want to let you know that we are behind you 100% in this fight against Lord Voldemort. And we will not stop until you have defeated him. This has got to be the most awkward hug of all time. No, oh, Draco, you alright? I don't know. I just had the 
sudden urge to one-up Harry Potter. Well, what are you waiting for, Draco? Come! As you all know, Draco was integral to our attack on Hogwarts last year. He fixed the vanishing cabinet and it helped Severus Snape assassinate Albus Dumbledore. So, in light of this, I am making Draco a full Death Eater. Ah, uh, yes! You're on, Draco! Okay. Oh, 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 oh okay. Stop hurting. Along with this position, I'm giving Draco a mission. Hey, Voldemort. Voldemort. Hey. Hey, Voldemort. 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 Yes? Can you hear me? In this? Your mission! Hey. Hey. Hey, Vol- Hey. Take a seat. Find the Potter boy and bring him back alive. That goes for all of you. If you find Potter, bring him to me. I must be the one to kill the Potter boy. Unfortunately, there is a complication. My wand and Potters are brothers. I cannot defeat him until I have another wand. Lucius. Oh, oh, hey, hey. I require your wand. Oh, well, you know, if you insist. Excellent. We need to pay a trip to the Ministry of Magic. Hey, that was a good um, wedding donut. Thanks. I like it. The Ministry has fallen. They're looking for Scrimjar. They'll be here any second. Run! Crime Jower's dead! Ah. Ah. Not so fast. Agent died! Change. No way, you dirty. Mundungus? Mundungus Fletcher. At your service. What are you doing here? I live here. It's, you know, it's bigger on the inside. Ten by ten. Wait, why aren't you just living in grim old place? You know, I tried, but the last person locked it. What, I always lock the door before I leave. You always lock it? I always lock it. Well, why'd you lock it? I always lock it. Lock it, lock it, lock it. Even my friends lock it. I'm not even there, and they lock it. They lock it at Grimmauld Place. Uh, wait. Mundungus! What? Two years ago, when I met you at Grimmauld Place, you had a locket. What, what was that? Just some old thing. I think it belonged to Sirius's brother Regulus or something. Before he died or whatever. Meh. What did it look like? It was silver, it was sort of old, so I couldn't sell it. Believe me, I tried. But it had some weird green S on it, you know. Harry, that sounds like the locket you and Dumbledore found. That could be a Horcrux. Hermione. Can we be politically correct here? Respectable lady crux? Come on. Monungus, do you think it's still in Grimmauld Place? Only one way to find out. <sighs> Nick, I haven't been to that old place since, well, you know what happened to completely serious. Let's go. What happened to completely serious? I think he dies. I don't know. 